Hi everyone, today I am with uh, another blogger, a fashion blogger, Yutika Nagesa, and we are going to be talking uh, to her and find out what she's about and what her blog is about. Um, welcome, Yutika, how are you? Thank you, I'm good, how are you? Very oh. happy to be here. Oh, are you? Are you good with the, there's no bees around? No, 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 but if the bees do come, guys, I'll be gone. <laughs> I'll click, then I'll be running, so just be prepared. So Yutika is uh, fresh out of, uh, now I won't say university, she's, uh, she's actually a qualified pharmacist and yes, she's in the middle of doing her community service, so she is a beauty with a purpose at the moment. <laughs> And you started your blog last month. Yes, so I've actually had the domain and I've had the website for a while, but um, I used to post things and then I would go back and read it and I would just doubt myself. But this year, I felt confident and I stopped caring, you know, what people think. People can take it, people can leave it. I love what I do. I do it for myself, okay. self-expression. So that's why I decided to go for it last month. And do you want to tell me about your blog? So it is a beauty and lifestyle and fashion blog. Um, I've always loved style. I've always loved putting together looks and garments and creating different masterpieces. So it's a blog that focuses on that, but the name of the blog is Be Youthful, which focuses on being yourself, being beautiful, being youthful, and just being unique. Because I feel like in today's day and age, you know, there's just too much of pressure put on people to try and be a certain way or to conduct themselves in a certain way. And that's not true to who they are. And I feel like they sell themselves short. So I just want to inspire people to take whatever it is, if it's trends or style, or see how I incorporate my personality into what I wear or what I do, and hopefully inspire them to do the same. And it's also a play on my name, <laughs> Yutika. <laughs> uh, what's your personal style, favorite? So my personal style, I would definitely describe as um, Indo-Western. I love adding bohemian touches to my looks. Um, um, I love that whole desi vibe. So, and I think that's different in our like society right now and South Africa with the blogging scene there's not many people that are doing that so I hope to inspire people to embrace that culture also well. we were talking off camera and some of the things this girl wears I think she can only pull it off but it's it's so, it's so <laughs> no. like fresh and gypsy and bohemian and, yes. and it's it's just it, it, it's so it, it's absolutely unique uh, she did a photo shoot recently with uh, UV UV current and uh, if you if you are curious and you're not sure what I'm talking about go and have a look at her page we'll give you the details later but it's just so fun and fresh and that's actually what caught my eye uh, when you started your blog it just those pictures spoke exactly spoke it spoke your brand yeah um, so but apart from the blog what do you do in your spare time so I'm a dancer dancing is was my first love I learned to dance before I learned to walk wow yes. when when did you start dancing so I was dancing in my grandparents living room since I was like two but I officially started going for classes uh, when I was six okay. so I'm a classically trained Kathak dancer I graduated in 2013 with Nateshwar mm -hmm. um, but we also do like um, shows and events and games and things like that if there's anything and any of the big events that you'd like to uh, name drop uh so i've done chala cinema i'm sure you guys have heard about that and then i've done notch um and the eastern evening and things like that I actually recently choreographed for the first time okay. last year so that was also a big step in my dancing career to get creative uh, so that was also really cool oh, wow and then also on the apart from the dancing you also are uh, you also believe in healthy living and you're doing something also quite exciting over the weekend. Yes, you share that so I am currently doing a yoga teacher's training course. So uh, yoga has also allowed me to find balance in my life. Uh, that's a huge thing. I was actually telling Rio earlier, the right and the left side of my brains need to be balanced. That's been a thing for me from when I was really young. My dad's a pharmacist, my mom's a music teacher. So it's like a thing that's been installed in us for as long as I can remember. So yoga definitely helps with that. And soon I'll be a yoga teacher. So if I'm having lessons, I'll let you guys know as well. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. I'm a bit double jointed for that, <laughs> but I can come watch. <laughs> um, Yutika, um, well, Valentine's Day, Valentine's Day is coming up. Uh, do you have any plans? 
So um, I will be working, so I work really far out because I'm doing my community service in a township at the moment, so I'll be getting home really late, but hopefully we can make some plans with my valentine. So you have a valentine? I do have a valentine, I've had one for a while. Okay guys, so that answers your question that you were looking for. Um, lastly, you know, it's been absolutely amazing having you on the blog. Uh, we could, I think we can talk for another, the whole yeah, day. Yeah, having so fun, so much fun now, I don't want to do <laughs> If we carry on, uh, okay, so, okay, so we'll, we'll, we'll make it last a little bit longer. I'm just going to ask you a few. I, ha I had a page somewhere, but I don't know where it is. Oh, okay. So I'm just going to try to think off the top of my head. I'm going to ask you a few questions to get to know you better okay. uh, for our viewers. Um, and, uh, you know, so my followers and your followers can get to know you. What's your star sign? I'm a Cancer, Cancerian. Okay. And uh, what is your favorite? Do you watch sport? Do you have a favorite sport? I'm um, not much of a sports girl. If my dad would be so sad to hear because he's totally into sports. Mm -hmm. But um, because of my dad and my boyfriend, I have to watch soccer. So I would say, yeah. Do you have a favorite sports team? Um, I think I'm, I have to say Manchester United. <laughs> if I don't say that, I can see the following going. <laughs> you're losing followers as we speak. Okay, and then what is, do you have a favorite movie? Um, oh, it's so hard to choose one. I love movies. I love Bollywood. What type of I'm a Bollywood fan through and through. Um, I love comedies, chick flicks. I love movies that are real. Okay. Um, I don't like the oh, fairy, you know. Do you have a favorite actor or actress? Um, I would have to say I'm really loving Alia Bhatt, mostly because she's actually a year older than me. Oh, wow. So it's really inspiring to see what she's done okay. with her life in such a short space of time. Like, we can do the same, guys. You know, we put our minds to something. Who, get is, who would you consider to be your inspiration or role model personally in your life? Um, I have so many. I love to take different things from different people that I meet. Um, my mom has definitely been a role model for me, especially with style. My mom, I really looked up to her ever since I was young. Um, but yeah, I just love taking things from different people I meet because everyone has something so original and authentic to give. So there's lessons all around us and that's just really special. Do you have a favorite color? Pink. Oh, of course. <laughs> not, not a question, guys. It's not a question. <laughs> um, favorite holiday destination? Um, oh, God, that's so hard. I went to New York two years ago, and that place stole my heart. So I'm dying to go back. It's definitely on the top of my list. Okay, and then for anybody watching right now who doesn't, who are, who's thinking of Valentine's Day plans, do you have any advice or suggestions for them? I think that there is a movie screening happening at the Botanical Gardens, if I'm not mistaken. I'm sorry if it's the wrong venue, but there I is a right. movie screening happening. I think you can buy tickets and go there. I think that would be really cool if the weather's good, being on a picnic blanket yeah. outside under the stars for Valentine's Day with a glass of wine. So I don't need to ask the next question, but you're definitely a romantic. <laughs> yes, of course I am. Definitely. Okay, well, the last thing we're going to do before we go, I'm going to give you about 20 seconds to tell everybody where to find you on social media it's how you want to use your 20 seconds it's up to you but uh, I'm gonna count you down and here you go okay guys uh, so I'm obviously on Instagram so you can find me my handle is at Yutika Nagesa and then um, my blog is www.beyouthful.co.za I'm also on Facebook um, you can like my blog page on Facebook it's at Be Youthful blog so yeah, for now I'm on those platforms and I hope that you guys will follow and enjoy the content that I put out there. Okay, awesome. Well, this is one of the longest videos I've done, <laughs> clearly, but it's Sorry. been really fun and it's been, uh, yeah, as I said, we could talk a whole lot, yeah. it's been really fun and just know that I really admire and respect uh, what you're doing. I think it's amazing for somebody with 23, 23 yeah. year old, 20, she's 23. Mm -hmm. um, uh, to do something of the magnitude that you're doing, something positive. Uh, I'm a mom of girls, I keep on emphasizing that, and I, I love the message um, that strong young women like you are bringing to the party. I mean, it gives, it gives me hope in the sense that my children have somebody, to, some people to look up to. So keep doing what you're doing. Thank you so and much for having me. If I need a, a prescription medication, I will be coming to you. <laughs> yeah, just call me. <laughs> okay, so bye guys. Bye. bye. Thanks for watching.